Wow, there's not much light in this room, which is probably a good thing. You see less of me. I look kind of like Johnny Depp after he got his eyes drilled out in Once Upon a Time in Mexico. Yeah. And poor Abigail, I'm still on drugs, right? I've got this tramadol Vicodin cocktail just washing its way through my veins. And um, poor, I haven't had the gin and tonics, Abigail says. And, I, and so she's lying there on her bed trying to read. And I am pontificating and waxing poetic and saying stupid shit like, Abigail, we need to carpe diem, baby. Live our lives like there's the next moment isn't guaranteed. We should go paddling around Morro Bay and hiking. <laughs> and she's like, yeah, you know, Cheryl, that was 15 years ago. We've gotten old, you dumb shit. <laughs> oh, my God. So, I'm, you know, I'm doing really well. I, I don't know what time it is. It's evening on the night of my, um, you know, on the day of the surgery. It's still the first day. And, you know, this really isn't that bad so far. I'm just, I'm trying to show you pictures of the room, but it's too dark. Um, this room is really kind of cool. Uh, maybe you can see over that way. Two beds, which is nice, because I snore and I would kick Abigail out. I take up almost as much room as a cat. And, oh, I know, I can do a 360. I'm going to do a 360. So anyway, yeah, nice little room. The Encina, Encinas, I think, a Best Western Suites Motel. It's got a really nice kitchen in there with a... It's a full-on kitchen. I mean, you could live here. I'm thinking about living here for the rest of my life. I could be so happy. It's right here in this room. So anyway, okay, my hand's going to go in front of the camera. All right. So anyhow, you know, this is pretty freaking comfortable for for a recovery. And, um, I'm not even, yeah, okay. So anyhow, I'm going to quit yapping at, at you guys. I'll go yap at Abigail for a while until she tells me to shut the fuck up. I'm trying to sleep. All right. Bye.